What is going on, everybody? It is Melted Gore, and this is the truth about toilets. Sorry about the quality real quick. I don't have my camera on me. Can't find it. I don't know where the fuck it is. I don't know what's going on. Uh, I haven't used it in quite a while. I hope I didn't leave it in Philly. I don't think I did, but um, because I'm pretty sure I used it not too long ago. But anyway, I'm going to get right into this. So I never understood why toilets have a toilet seat cover. Um, toilet seat we'll talk about next. But the toilet seat cover never made sense to me. It's like, what did they think? Like, oh, you don't want to get anything dirty inside the toilet. You know, like, what? I, I don't understand why we have a cover. Um, it makes no sense to me. I was just thinking about that. This is the most random video ever. But, um... It just never made sense. It's like, oh, you know what, Billy? You better put that seat cover down. You don't want to get dust in there. I don't know. Next is the seat itself. So I get the purpose of the seat, obviously. But why not just make the rim of the toilet thicker so you can sit right on the, the rim? I don't know. Make the hole in the center bigger? I mean, I get the whole pee on the seat thing, but... If it was bigger, it wouldn't really be a problem. Another thing that really kind of bugs me about toilets that never made sense is public bathrooms. The place you use the last, like the least amount. I mean, the average person doesn't use a public bathroom that often. And the average person doesn't take a shit in a public bathroom. At least I don't because that is disgusting um, to me anyway. But I'm kind of, I don't know. I am weird like that, I suppose but I'm a clean person. In public bathrooms, like nine times out of ten, they have these really fancy toilets. When you flush them, everything gets sucked down like it's the end of the world. It's like you press that button and it's like... <coughs> press that button. <coughs> what? Why don't they make these for residential purposes? We wouldn't need plungers ever. The plunger is the grossest thing in any house. You take a nasty-ass shit and it won't go down, so there you are plunging away at your poop water, and then you sit it right back on the floor. Blah. Another weird thing I wanted to talk about, just because I was told this a while ago and I had to look it up because I was so curious, and there's a toilet-themed restaurant in Taiwan, and the food is served on miniature toilets. Like, they have these little model, like, probably like this big... Maybe, and, and all the food's inside the toilet, and you eat out of the toilet bowl. Weirdest fucking thing ever, but I just wanted to share that because it's like the weirdest fact ever. Another thing that's kind of weird, and maybe this ties into why commercial toilets aren't used in residential, you know, the ones that go <laughs> and sucks everything away and puts it into some gross box that's buried beneath the grass. Um, that's a septic, for those of you who don't know. The average person spends about five cents per flush. Maybe the commercial ones, since they're sucking everything down, it's a little more cost effective, or it costs a little more. I don't know. I don't care. I would pay a lot more than five cents per flush if I knew I didn't have to have a poop stick sitting on my floor every day. That would be nice, but you know, we can't all live like Jesus, I guess. But anyway, I just want to say that toilet seat covers make no sense at all. Um, the whole point of the seat is to not fall in. Is the cover going to prevent that even further? I mean, how many people stumble into their toilet when this cover's up? I don't know. Never made sense. But remember, keep that toilet seat cover down so you don't get your toilet dirty. Because, you know, when you take a shit, it's super clean. Anyway, guys, I just want to say thank you for checking out the super short, super random, super stupid video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up down there. Let's see if we can reach. I don't care. Just give me some. And if you really like this video, hit that subscribe button. I want to do more of these kind of comedic, stupid videos that are random and just kind of blabber on about random topics because I really want to do more kind of vlogging, more personal stuff rather than games. I do do game stuff, but not as often as a lot of YouTubers just because YouTube is flooded with that crap. But I also do vlogging on game development and, and stuff like that. I'm also waving my hands a ridiculous amount. But remember, commercial toilets. <laughs>